Climate change affects all of humanity, and we need lots of young people interested in mitigating its impacts. This is a big and scary problem, and it can be hard to know how to engage with it. The Innovate to Mitigate project empowers students to tackle this daunting global problem and to feel like they can make a difference. Using a project-based learning approach, students work in groups to come up with ways to mitigate climate change, and they then present their ideas to an online community of other students, scientists, and former participants. They use these crowdsourced conversations to refine their ideas and to submit a video of their final project to an online competition where the conversation continues. Students have come up with new types of windmills, more efficient methods for composting to reduce methane emissions, campaigns for no-till farming, and numerous other ideas, all while working in a classroom or after-school setting. This project focused on using a manual composting machine. What if the textile industry implemented a closed-loop system that uses treated wastewater and sludge to grow the crops textiles are made from? If we can simulate 10% more rain using a tensile coil, then we could potentially reduce carbon emissions by 10%. Our research data shows that by presenting their work for public scrutiny and by crowdsourcing their ideas, students practice an authentic scientific process. They're coming up with an idea, arguing about it, and gathering evidence to see whether it's working or not. One element that was really intellectually challenging for the students was the crowdsourcing aspect. It really pushed them to sharpen their ideas and to stretch their thinking uh, both about the ways in which they could see impacting climate change positively and about potential other options that were out there that might also be just as effective. I know that young people care about climate change and care about the future, so giving them a chance to do something positive that kind of moves one step in the right direction seemed really empowering. You know, instead of, I feel frustrated, I feel discouraged, they can say, well, what's something that might make this just a little bit better in my community? The Innovate to Mitigate project seemed risky to me when I started because I didn't know what I would have to show for it at the end. And it turned out to be the most educationally meaningful experience of the whole year. To learn more about Innovate to Mitigate, visit our website. And there's still time to sign up for next year's competition.